Hi, welcome to Learning Monkey. I am Vikram. In this class, we will try to solve some examples on printf and scanf functions. So, the concept of printf, of, uh, printf and scanf functions like what is the written value of a printf statement and scanf statement has already been discussed in our previous video. Hoping that you have watched that video, we are discussing these examples. If you haven't watched, those, watched that video, please watch that video and come back here. And every video on our channel is going to be a part of entire course or a playlist. Our suggestion is to follow the entire course so that that you can have better understanding of the concepts and the link for the playlist is provided in the description below now let's try to uh, directly answer these uh, 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 this this line of code uh, red uh, the line of code which is there in uh, red color uh, which is in re red color so what this scanf is going to generate so it is going to produce an output of uh, where it will ask for two inputs for example if you have given uh, uh, 10 20 so uh, uh, 1020 and it will give the return value the return value of this scanf is going to be 2 as two values has been successfully scanned so the uh, the return value of the scanf is the number of values that are successfully scanned two values got successfully scanned and it is going to produce an output of 2 and we are going to print this printf function is going to print 2 and similarly if you take this printf percent sd uh, in that we are having another printf so what is the return value of a printf statement the return value of the printf statement is the number of characters that it has printed so total it is 16 characters 16 characters and uh, percent sd 16 uh, so it is going to print uh, 16 okay very simple examples but for better understanding uh, we have taken some more examples okay so uh, this this example is bit bigger but it's very simple so the innermost uh, uh, innermost printf statement so this is the outer one this is the outermost printf uh, okay and within that we are having uh, this printf and within this printf we are having this scanf first it is going to wait for the innermost one is scanf this scanf first it is going to wait for uh, it is going to wait for this scanf to get executed in the sense it will ask for us to give the input for example if we have given 10 so uh, how many values it has scanned one value so that one value is the return value of this so one will return to this uh, here number of items read uh, percentage d uh, slash new line so it is in this percentage d it is going to put one okay so now this acts as the input for this printf statement number of bytes printed is equal to percentage d slash n so uh, what it is going to print so it is going to print so the number of characters or uh, for example if it is 17 assume that it is 17 so i am not counting so that 17 will be produced as the input to this and uh, that will get printed okay n u e m so all these spaces with all these spaces if there are 17 assume that there are 17 characters those 17 characters so uh, this scanf and this is the input for this printf so this printf whatever the characters that it printends uh, that it prints those number of characters will be shown uh, as the in as the output of this uh, percentage d so it is going to print 17 okay so let's try to uh, execute this on our computer and see how the outputs will be okay uh, here uh, first one compiled we'll do it fastly okay so it is asking for inputs 10 22 inputs are there two has been printed and this one uh, okay number of bytes so it is our uh, third example so the bigger example so it is asking for one input see here number of items read one and number of bytes printed 19 so we, we have considered it as 17 it is 19 okay uh, third example okay so it has to print 16 
okay so this is this is uh, how th these are the different ways in which the printf and scanfs can be used within the printfs uh, or scanfs hope you got the clarity on this concept thanks for watching if you haven't subscribed to our channel please subscribe to our channel and press bell icon for the latest updates and if you have any doubts regarding this concept please post your doubt in the comment section below and if you feel that this video is helpful to you please give us a like symbol and please share this video with your friends so that they will also get benefited thanks for watching